Hey guys, it's Thrill again and Valve released a new case today. It's the Chroma case number 2, which um, still has the 6 knife finishes that we know from the original Chroma case in them. Um, so you can still get the knives with Rust Coat, Tiger Tooth, um, Marble Fade Doubler, Ultraviolet and Damascus Steel in those cases. And on top of that, of course, some new weapon skins. For example, this AK-47 Elite build right here, which is actually a common weapon. So I think that's pretty nice. We finally have a new nice looking AK-47 skin that's common, so everyone is going to be able to afford that one. And in general, I think most of these skins in there look pretty nice. I got myself 20 of these cases. Those were pretty damn, damn expensive. I paid like $9 for each of those cases. And you also have to bear in mind that there are new keys for those cases, so you cannot open those cases with the old Chroma case key. And yeah, let's jump right into it. Um, obviously, I really want to get one of those rare skins right here, like the Mac 10 or the M4A1S. Then I also really like the Galil AR Eco. The Orb Worm God would also be pretty decent to get from the blue ones. I like the sort of Origami and of course the AK-47 Elite build, which I would really like to get today. Um, just to show it to you what that looks like. All right, I think I will jump right in Obviously, I would also not mind to get a knife out of these 20 cases since I spent a ton of money for all those crates and keys And we will already start with a pretty decent skin the orb worm god And that's what it looks like um, Not actually that sure anymore if I like it that much. I mean, it's all right. I could definitely sell it for a bit on the market. Moving on to the second case. Um, and I think to even make profit out of this... Oh, just missing the Setrack AK Elite build. Crap. But let's have a look at that MP7 armor core first. That one looks actually pretty cool. I think that might be my new favorite MP7 skin. I really like it. Especially like that silver scratch metal up here. I really like that look. Um, what was I about to say? Ah, yeah. Probably won't make profit out of this case opening unless I get a knife or a really nice stat track rare skin. But my goal is basically to show you as many skins from those cases as possible. This is the AK-47 Elite build, probably in battle scarred since it has literally no paint on it. So let's check. Yeah, it's in battle scarred. But I mean, 20 more cases to go. It's a common weapon, so I might be able to show you a good-looking AK-47 Elite build. The next gun will be another MP7 armor core though. That's a skin I already had, so I'm just moving on. Come on, Gaben. Oh no. I just saw that M4A1S Hyper Beast flying by, but at least I get a CZ um, pole position. Which I think I like that. That really looks cool, I think. All these cases in there, uh, the skins in those cases, I really like most of these. Next up, we will have the sort of origami that I also wanted to show you. Hope that's in a good condition also. Yeah, that looks pretty nice. Yeah, I like that skin. I like the orange yellow stuff. It's in fact new, even nice. I'm definitely gonna keep that. Next up, we will... No! <laughs> Oh, I really would also like to show that to you. It's a 5.7 monkey business. This one is another elite build, also literally no paint on it, probably in well worn. It's in battle scarred again, so I'm not getting that luck with the A case right now. But there's still plenty of cases to come. That is nice. That must be nice. A Star Trek P250 Valence. I hope I'm pronoun pronouncing that right, Valence. That one looks alright to me. I think they're decent. Um, that should go for at least 5 euros on the market. A minimal wear stat track. That must be at least 5 euros. That's a keeper. Alright. Case number 10. Probably somewhere around there. Will give us another new skin. The Negev Manowar. Um, the Manowar is... Yeah, that's the same from the Orb Manowar. That might be the best looking Negev, Negev skin out there currently. Even though it looks pretty much like the anodized navy, um, apart from these golden stripes on it. No! Oh, I'm so, if I get a blue one out of this case. Oh, the Statrek MP7 armor core. That's nice. I'm gonna definitely I'm gonna play that. But right at the start of this case, I freaking see the Mac 10 Neon Rider and the M M4A1S Hyper Beast next, right next to each other. 
This one has some field tests. It looks perfectly fine to me, though. Oh, I thought this unboxing started off really good with the orb. But it's turning into shit once again. Another P250 Valence. Alright, I'm definitely halfway through. I think even more than halfway through now. Oh, come on. These cases were so expensive. I need at least one good skin to make it up a bit, at least. Not with those sort of origamis, though. Alright, come on. One lucky case. Or give me at least a skin that I would really like. Like to play, like the Galil AR Eco. Meanwhile, I'm just getting more and more of those armor cores, even though I like the skin, but I don't need more than one of those. Come on. Oh, it's another armor core. Also in Stat Trek, though. Um, let's see, the last one was in field tested, so that might be an upgrade to Factory New Minimal Wear. It's also in field tested, so yeah. Don't really care about that. And come on now, last six cases, I think, already. Missing all those nice skins, and it's another Negev Manowar. I really didn't get that lucky with the old Chroma cases as well. I mean, I got a knife, a single knife. I opened like five or six hundred of the old Chroma cases. Um, and that was literally by far the best that I got out of them, my flip knife tiger tooth. But other than that, I did not really get lucky with the old Chroma cases, and it looks like I'm not gonna get really not gonna get lucky with the new ones either. This one is another CZ pole position, which I said earlier, I really like that one, so that's alright. And next up, we'll have another P250 Valence. Just gonna skip that, we had that. And here we go, last three cases already. It started off really good with this orb, Worm God, but lots and lots of blue after that. Ah, uh, I hate that. I had to get teased by the really nice skins flying by and it's gonna be a freaking blue in the end all the time. And right here again, the freaking new rider right at the start. And there it is again! No! Fuck! At least it's another skin that I didn't show off so far. It's a Desert Eagle Bronze decal. That looks alright to me, not gonna be my favorite deagle skin. Um, yeah, it's in fact factory new at least, so moving on to the very last case That has to be my lucky case now to make To make up for a huge loss on my steam wallet But I only see blue and of course it's going to be blue in the end Wow I definitely lost a lot of money on this case opening and that is also definitely below average I only got three purples out of 20 cases three static blue skins um, yeah, that was pretty unlucky, I guess. I'm sorry that I couldn't show um, show you more of those skins, like at least a single pink or a red, maybe even, but yeah, my luck is not there today. All right, then that's it for this case opening. I hope you still enjoyed it. Um, let me know what you think about those cases and especially what's your favorite skin out of these new Chroma cases number two. And yeah, with that being said, good luck on your own case openings and I will see you in my next video.